crocodiles. We Brits have increasingly adventurous appetites, and it doesn't get any more exotic than croc meat. Uh, g'day, mate. I noticed um, that you guys sell crocodile burgers. I just wonder where you get it from. I mean, do you send out a team of crocodile hunters? <laughs> no, I don't know. I mean, how do you catch a crocodile? I couldn't tell you. Do you think they go out hunting them? Because it's really dangerous. They eat people. I think they just beat general crocodile hunters that hunt them to sell them as crocodile. I wouldn't like to be out there, though. <laughs> Oh, my word, no way, no way. In search of crocodiles, I'm travelling 24 hours and halfway around the world to Darwin in northern Australia. I'm about 20 hours into my trip. Out the window is my first glance of Australia. And it really doesn't look like there are many people down there at all. There's lots of wildlife. It's hot, it's sticky, but no chance of a quick dip to cool off. The waters in these parts are hiding over 100,000 wild crocodiles. I'm heading to Croc Central on the Adelaide River, two hours east of Darwin. Crumbs! I hope they're not going to be that big. I'm meeting Connie Cupid, a real live crocodile dundee and wrangler of the razor-toothed reptiles. G'day, Kate. I'm Connie. So, Connie, we're going to spot some crocs. My word, yeah, today. Crocodile attacks are a constant threat in these parts, so I'm sticking close to Connie. What kind of crocodiles are we looking for? Saltwater crocodiles. Crocodilus porosus. And how big are we talking? The biggest one that I've interacted with has been a six metre saltwater crocodile. Six metres? Are there crocs all around us right now? Ah, uh, yes. Every hundred metres that we go through this river, there's at least one to two saltwater crocodiles. The man-eating variety. And they're aggressive at this time of the year, and they're very hungry. This is quite terrifying. Yes, we just can't see them. And what would be your chances if you think you'd run on to go for a swim here? Nothing. No chances at all. They'd be on to you in a heartbeat. You might want to look over your shoulder now. <gasps> <laughs> this here is like an over five metre male saltwater crocodile. There we go. He's looking a little bit dubious there, Skip. Look at his teeth. That was uh, one tonne of closing down jaw power per metre crocodile there. Never heard a sound like it. It was like a trap door closing. It's adrenaline pumping, isn't it? <laughs> Don't go for a dip in Darwin. This is another five metre crocodile. OK. Look at the size of him. How on earth does anyone haul one of those out of the water and onto our plates? We don't do anything like that out here. So, do we eat saltwater crocs? Ah, yes, we do. And they're yummy. But not a croc like this? No. They're a protected species. So if we don't eat those, what crocodiles do we eat? You're eating crocodiles from a crocodile farm. Crocodile farm? Who's got Jack, mate? 